Hey, man, but we're in the shame culture right now. Hey, man, yeah. you can't say nothing without getting shamed now. Now it's like, oh, shame on you. Listen, that's the way people feel. People feel like there's nothing wrong with shaming other people. It's like, literally, this is my job to make sure you know how to be politically correct. or this and So it's shaming everybody. You right. shouldn't be doing yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. What are you doing? Listen, man, I went to Shanghai for the holiday. Okay, Shanghai, Shanghai China. I always yeah. wanted to go. You never been there? I've never been. Great. Always wanted to go. It Good was time. fantastic. Why that place? Because I, I wanted to go somewhere that was totally off the grid, you like want- like east west. I had never been that far east. Yeah, you went with the family. Went with the family. I yeah. took them all. But I was shamed. People were like, "What are you doing in China? Do you know what they're doing to the Muslims? You know what they're doing to really? Hong Kong? You know what I'm going? Oh, dude, it caused a controversy, and I'm sitting there like, wait a minute. So, it, okay, first of all, I'm in China. But Apple's here too. Nike's here too. Like, so you're never gonna use your iPhone again? Yeah. You know what I mean? I was like, why? why? why and why are they taking all the anger on you? Because they feel powerless against Nike and Apple. And, yeah. And you're just a guy on vacation. And I'm just a guy on vacation. But you can be bro. made an example of. Exactly. And that and that's a shame him. Shame him. Yeah. Shame on you. And I'm going, hey man. But first of all, and this is Americans who 30 years ago, if I'd have been trying to do the things I'm doing right now, I'd have been lynched. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to tell you. Yeah. Hey man, when I was a kid, we would go down south. We couldn't stop. My, we would put a chicken in the, uh, a whole chicken, cooked chicken in the trunk, and a Hills Brothers coffee can. Because when we got hungry, we just ripped off a piece of chicken. If we had to pee, we peed in the Hills Brothers coffee can because we knew it wasn't safe for us to stop. No restaurants, no hotels. Right. So stop coming to me about oh my god, human rights abuses. I'm like, hey man, this is America. Yeah. Wait a minute. Do you You're, understand what this country is? Right. You're not getting any shame from the black community? Oh, I, I've been shamed by the black community. Yeah. Big time. I, I've been viewed as a sellout. People say, because you're smiling on TV. Yeah. Uh, hey, man. Uh, well, I, I'm happy. You, oh, you're going to be the happy Negro, huh? <laughs> really? you going to shuck for the man. Cooning. And I'm going, okay. <laughs> wow. So we can't be happy. <laughs> so I must be an angry black man at all times. <laughs> So, it, unless I'm not, I'm not standing for the cause. Right. And so you go, oh, okay. And then you realize, dude, this is like, no what can I that. say, man? There's it's no, no way. Like, yeah, you got, it's the same thing like you said about your family. At some point, you got to create some space for yourself. Exactly. Right? Exactly. 